you know. Uh, 28 going on 50. Like, oh, it's proper good, man. They're like... The shooting star press, which I proper Brock Lesnar'd. And then, um, yeah. Proper I, Brock Lesnar'd. Yeah. Proper. Dude, I didn't proper. realize, like, how much of the difference there is between, like, Imagine. American English and English English. You got a Wild Greens. You got a Wild Greens, man. <laughs> Siri, Pizza Hut. Siri, call me Big Sweaty Ball Bag. You would like me to call you Big Sweaty Ball Bag. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think, as a dad, like, you've got a certified dad dick now? Like, when you hold your own piece, do you look at it and think, I reckon this is a respectable dad dick? I do start referring to my balls as the Jackie Makers. The what? So the Jackie Makers, because my son's Jack, right? So... <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I took him on a road trip with me a while ago. I put him in the front seat, and as I got into the car, he just turned to me and he's like, Dad. I'm like, yeah. He's like, I'm a bad motherfucker. <laughs> You've always like, dieted well, haven't you? <laughs> you always have, I've done. Uh, no, Alright, you were in shape once. <laughs> once upon a time, <laughs> I was yeah, in shape. But Especially before matches, like, I can take a good seven chips before, like, he needs to get. I've got ABS. It's bad, mate. Vicky didn't say yes at the beginning. No. Vic, do you want to get on this sofa with us? You might as well join in for a bit in a minute. Right, this is Mark's wife. What perfume are you fucking wearing? That strip wallpaper? That one. Oh god! First date I took her on was we went dogging. You know what dogging is, Michael? So, dogging, Michael, imagine this. There is a meeting point where couples will go in their vehicles. So, like, say the local park at, at the middle of the night and go in their vehicles in these automobiles and they will have sex in the automobiles and people will show up in other automobiles and stand outside, peering into the window while these couples But... Sorry. Cut this from the DVD if I die. Dude, we'll, we'll make triple if you do. You know what I mean? So. I don't know, I won't make any money, I'll be dead! People watch the show, I suppose. Mm. The only way they're gonna watch the show if there's a murder on here anyway. <laughs> What's this generation of wrestlers gonna talk about, do you know what I mean? Like, Hey man, remember when we hit that, you know, home run on Madden? I got addicted to Tinder. Man, <laughs> no, yeah. hey man, yeah. remember, remember those days when you'd get with the hotel, four hour car journey, and then you put NXT on when you got home on the network? That was the shit, man. Right. Back in the day, I used to darn my Red Bull and then post an MV on Twitter. I was just thinking though, how amazing would it be if Tinder was like Uber and you could like, Track it so you see like your booty call getting closer. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Did you get on with Vic's parents straight away? No problem. Um, the first thing that Vic's mom said when she saw me was, "He looks like Jesus." Um, so yeah. Um, back when I was in the group with the chaps, we wanted to be renamed the Fruit Bowl, and we would have the the tag team would be pears. Right? The, there would be an apple whose finish was the apple tree of woe. And then we had the banana whose moves were the banana rana, the banana split legged moonsault, and the fruit and fiber driver. Imagine if there was like the fruit bowl and then there was the, you know, the cabbage patch or whatever, right? Or like the vegetable group. And like they're warring over the tomato who's technically a fruit but is more associated with vegetables. And then we came up with a gimmick called the pedos and speedos. They feud with anybody with the word kid in their names, like Kid Cash or. Johnny Kid. <laughs> it's money right there, mate. This is awkward. <laughs>